Hello, hello. Since my channel has a lot of DOI videos, then you all most likely have seen 18650 battery elements. Those batteries are lithium ion cells that provide high energy. So today I'll show you where to find these batteries for free. Let's be gold diggers together because one such original battery costs around $4. Very cheap, yes? Where can this gold be found? The easiest way is old laptop batteries. 18650 elements are inside them. These laptop batteries can be obtained for free, for example, found at home, picked up from friends or from disposed old laptops. Well, you could say that those are old and not working batteries. That's true. But very often, they don't work because inside only one of the batteries is damaged, leaving the rest healthy. Sometimes when they don't get charged for a long time, they just go into deep sleep to save themselves. For this job, you'll need a couple of laptop batteries. The more you have, the more chances of finding good gold nuggets. But this job can and should be only performed by adults, who have asked their grandparents for permission. Before you do that, look up on YouTube 18650 battery explosions. It's dangerous. However, if you're ready to dig for some gold, then in addition to laptop batteries, you'll also need some DOI tools, a multimeter to check the condition of batteries, definitely glasses, and a metal or ceramic ball where to throw a battery that is going to explode. And in addition, you'll need one of those smart 18650 battery chargers. Take a deep breath and disassemble the first battery case. Some battery cases are easier to disassemble, some more difficult. When the case is open, try to separate the battery cells from the case. Here's the heart of the battery. Six pieces of 18650 batteries. This is the most common number of these cells in laptop battery. And this is a battery BMS, or you could say circuit board, that provides protection, monitoring, balancing, and other high-level functionality for a battery pack safety. This particular one is a Samsung laptop rechargeable battery with a DC voltage of 11.1 volts and a capacity of 4000 mAh. Inside, there are six Samsung ECR18650 20F lithium-ion cells. Let's open another laptop battery to see what kind of gold nuggets are inside. As you can see, there are LG ABD18650 cells, a better deal. If previous battery capacity was 2000 mAh, then this mentioned in specs is 3000 mAh. Third time's a charm. Let's open one Lenovo laptop battery. It's smaller, that also means less gold nuggets. And it actually is. Four instead of six cells. LG ABC21865 cells with 2800 mAh capacity. Not bad. I have some bad news. It's not victory yet because it's possible that all cells are damaged and dead. So we need to separate them and measure with a multimeter if any of them are actually usable. You can use pliers to separate them, but this is the part where you definitely need some stylish Ranger sunglasses, in case something goes wrong. Once the glasses are on, we can continue removing the batteries. They are glued, and in between there is a metal connecting tape, which we'll cut off. Remove the excess stuff and we have freed the first cell. Take the multimeter and see if there is any life in the battery. 1.55 volts, actually looks hopeful. The standard full 18650 cell should be 4.2 volts, minimal empty, 2.8 volts. The next ones are the same. 1.55 volts, the third 1.62 volts, and the last one is even more. Nice! Let's check other batteries if their status is as good as previous ones. Wow! 3.72 volts, it's a new cell. The next cell looks dead, that's fine, because battery is blocked and other elements should be intact. So what's up with the other cells? Ooh, very nice! Four new elements and the last one is dead. Not nice. After a couple of hours of work, I have gotten a nice pile of future gold nuggets. Now all these batteries need to be recharged to find out how many good 18650 batteries we got. Take a charger that has a test charge. It charges, discharges and then recharges the battery. And then just start charging every cell. A week later, at least that's the time it took me to recharge 41 battery, I got a nice deal. Out of 9 laptop batteries, I got 41 usable 18650 lithium ion batteries. All batteries were numbered, the capacity was found on the internet, also recharged, and the remaining capacity was noted, because they're not new batteries. But still, excellent for some LED flashlights, DUI Bluetooth speakers, and other projects. A single 18650 cell costs around $4. That means we just saved around $160. Very nice. And thank you for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe for risking my life showing you this gold digger stuff. If there are any suggestions or questions, feel free to write them in the comments. Thanks and see ya!